And so, um, uh, yeah, I copied your hard drive. <coughs> so, um, someone sent me this team, and I'm using it now. And, uh, like, it's pretty good. He said it was, like, made for the tea or something. I don't wait, like, um, it was, like, Spoon or someone, and they said, um, it's made to cover all of OU, pretty much, but I think it's more offensively than defensively, and I did change some things, so it's not, um, <clears throat> exactly how he sent it to me, but it's pretty dang close and stuff. So, yeah, he'll probably go for the HP Grass or Mega Evolve or both. But um, I'm going to stay and try and get my rocks up. And, yeah, so I will use a team more than likely if you send it to me. Um, this team has been eh, semi-successful, like 50-50 for my wins and losses, that is. But um, it's like, yeah, it definitely seems a little more offensive threatening than defensive and not not really it's just kind of balanced like it doesn't even have the hardest hitting things besides like Entei and that hits pretty hard but that's more of a thing where I find myself switching into hitting and then switching out of so yeah and I don't know what his Hydreigon is gonna do I'll go for the Scald as that does a little bit of damage and I get the flinch so that's perfect um what more could I ask for let me go into my Scarf Tyranitar which hasn't really helped me out with the Scarf yet and I'm one who has never really liked putting scarfs on slow items, except for when I first started and I put it on Viper. But um, that's a different story. And um, I think I'm just going to go for the Stone Edge. Yeah, Stone Edge seems like a good move. And um, he's going to U-turn, so he's like, what? You're scarfed, and now I'm dead, unless Starmie Rapid Spins. So con Conkeldor, Conkeldor, however people say this. I noticed a big thing. I'm not sure what I switched Breloom for. Oh, yes, I am. It's uh, Gyarados. But this team is extremely, extremely fighting weak. I guess this resisted, what I did, which I didn't even realize. I'm pretty sure that's quad resist, too. So, yeah, that's actually pretty awesome. I didn't even realize that. <laughs> and I'll go for the T-Wave just because the air move would be predicted. And I could see him going into, like... Heatran or Amph Ampharos. <coughs> know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, yeah. Let's see. What he wants to do? Um. I, I, that's what I would think. I would think switch to maybe even Starmie to one of the things that resists the flying or... Yeah, or I'll stay in and go for the Ice Punch or something. Yeah, go for the Ice Punch. Do a good, good amount of damage, and we'll just roost up a little bit. And he was paralyzed, too, so I guess he was going to go for the Mock Punch, I guess. And now I could probably T-Wave again, but I'm just going to play it safe. Go for that Air Slash. Kill him, or made him so he more than likely would not have been able to attack me. So now he's going to bring in Guard Trump. Um, see, this is another thing, like... I really don't have the best defense. Once again, I don't know if something's meant to be defensive. I didn't look at it all too well, but things like Garchomp, I just kind of have to forfeit things to, like, I'm pretty much going to have to f fodder Togekiss now. I don't even know what Garchomp Mega's stats are, but I am getting him down pretty low with Togekiss because of the misses and all, which is pretty great. And, yeah, he probably is Outrage or something. That's why he doesn't want to go for that. Because I'm sure his Stab Dragon move would have taken me out. Because, what is this thing? It's crazy stats. Garchomp. Mega. One, okay, so that's another pretty broken thing, in my opinion. So let's go into Entei. Go for that super strong choice banded. Extreme speed. For the win, he'll probably predict that going to his something. No, he's not, and that doesn't even freaking kill. So now I lost this game. <laughs> I think I did, though, actually, because... Uh, dang it, that's the game. Freaking Mega Evolutions OP. I need priority on every team. Oh, uh, why is there no grass type priority that hits really hard that Breloom has right now?
he can really destroy you. I guess he can, can't he? I need priority other than Entei. I need something, and I lost this game. <laughs> so he has EQ and Stone Edge. Maybe he doesn't have a dragon move, and I can go into Breloom and resist both of those things. So let's see. And uh, we'll go for... We'll go for the Seed Bomb. Because Seed Bomb seems like a good move to go for right now. So yeah. <laughs> Let's hope this guy goes a tad fast to start that timer showing we mean business. Because I really would like to get at least two battles done in this live thing, but I can't because people keep taking too long and stuff. So let's just look for another battle. I definitely lost that one. So yeah, if you send me a team or Pokemon, I'll try to use it. Something like that. Um, <clears throat> so, nothing weak to rocks, so rocks aren't going to be a priority. Let's lead off something else for a change, huh? Let's lead off with uh, Brelium. Counter his lead, put him to sleep, whatnot. Let's lead off with Heat Train. That's quite alright. You're going to uh, you're gonna sleep today. Or something is. <laughs> And uh, he might want to switch into his Venusaur after this. I don't know. Um, I might focus punch on the switch, or he switches directly into it. Okay. So what? Oh, because it's grass. I'm dumb. Why did I completely forget that? There were a bunch of things I completely forgot today. Actually, no, 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 no. Let's go into Entei, because I doubt he can Oko me. Um... Ew, even with the EQ that he predicted, oh my gosh. He definitely predicted me to go into Entei. I could have easily gone into Togekiss, but... he. Oh, and I went for that. Uh, I could have gone for a different move because he does have the Heat Train, which I'm pretty sure gets Flash Fire. So now I'm going to pull my Switch on out of there and go into... This dude, because he would probably go into Heatran, yeah. And let's set up our Stealth of Deluxe and um, see what he wants to go for. He'll probably switch into something, Chansey. Yeah. And we can knock off and get that E Violet out of there so it's not too crazy with the defenses. And, uh, yeah, then it should die to most physical attacks with its, like, five defense or something. So let's see if we lost this yet. So actually, he might lose because he's not moving. That's cool. So I'm decided I, I'm glad I decided to start this, per se. Let's go for the EQ now, see how much it wants to do. And, yeah, so it's going to do 33%. Not bad, not bad at all. So he's probably going to switch into that dang Venusaur. Um, I'm gonna go into Entei in case he does, but then that could, uh, that doesn't really help me very much. Now that I think about it, because he has the Heatran and stuff, so this is a fifty percent chance to burn. That's pretty cray, pretty cray cray. Let's go into Hydreigon because he showed me EQ. I'm sure he has a stab Grass move and a stab Poison move. So yeah. And we're going to set up a sub to see what he has. Yeah, I should be faster than everything. So this guy might be a little bit of a problem. Because I don't have anything. Well, I have one Pokemon to hit it super effectively. That's it. And he wants to bring in Cabfagrigus. That's no <coughs> threat to me at all. I can just go for the Dragon Pulse. Maybe two hit KO. Probably not. But <laughs> we'll see. We will see. Uh, why is everyone taking so long today? Oh, and why is everyone leaving? Alright, I'm going to have to end it on that. Because this guy freaking let me have his win. This guy is going to let me have, which would probably be his win. It would be very hard to get around Venusaur. And Skarmory, because Entei's at low. He probably has Hazard somewhere on his team. Bunch of counters to Entei. Bunch of counters to Entei. And, uh, yeah, so it just seemed like a more bulky team. That would be hard to handle, so, yeah. 
um, send me teams and pokes and stuff. I greatly appreciate them, though sometimes I don't respond. <laughs> yeah, see ya.